Hey, what's up friends? Moses here from the Driver Success Channel. I hope you guys are doing well. Um, today, I really need your opinion on something. I'm going to show you uh, some stuff and then I just want to, uh, to get your opinion. But before we do that, um, I did promise you guys that I will make a video showing you uh, when the t-shirts come in, the t-shirts I ordered from uh, the corporate website, those came in and I made a video yesterday. I was going, I was going to post it, then um, something came in which prompted me to make this video that I'm making right now. So I decided I would just wait and then combine the two videos and just release them at once. So before I get your opinion on what I want uh, you guys to... Uh, to look at let me first uh, play the video I made yesterday and then I'll be right back so as I promised that if these t-shirts come in I will be able to show them to you guys so they just came in and I'm putting on one of them so you can see how they look uh, I don't know if you can really tell from the video how the material looks but it's more like um, I don't know if I would say polyester or or nylon or spandex I don't know what material that is but it's kind of like a flowy material excuse me a flowy material I don't know if you can tell I ordered two of them the blue one and the white one and I like it because they are light they are really light they feel good um, which means that when it comes to the summer months this will be better than the ones that I had the ones that I had are more of a uh, a hard material and so those may work well in the in maybe like the fall months but they don't do well in the summer months so I'm happy with this that are a little light they really feel soft and good and this size that I'm putting on is extra small so unless you are as small as I am I would advise that um, you you get something bigger but but this is extra small and i like the way it fits um i like the way it feels i like the way it fits i like the fact that they are light in in in, in the feel and also colors because i had black and i had um like the khaki color but this is blue and white so um oh the other thing i was wondering is if they come with uh, with a JB Hunt logo, yes, they do come with a JB Hunt logo. Both of them have the JB Hunt logo. Uh, the other thing I've been surprised with is uh, these are made in Ghana. For those of you that don't know, Ghana is in uh, Africa, so these are made in Ghana. At first, I'm like, is that China? And then I realize it's Ghana. So, yeah, these are nice in the way they feel, but as I said, they are more for the uh, the summer or if you live in California and you have most mostly hot weather these are really good uh, yeah they're okay so that's it all right as I promised I just wanted to give you an update and show you uh, they took what about two or three weeks to come in which is a little longer than um, uh, Sintas. For Sintas, they usually, like you order them and within a couple of days, uh, you get them. So this took longer than Sintas takes, but uh, they are good. Okay, so now to the video that I'm talking about where I need your opinion. So I'm going to show you some videos and you are going to see how I'm dressed, the different types of dressing that, um, the way I'm dressed and then I need to know I want to get your opinion. Um, I don't know how I should separate them. Okay, let's say this. I'm going to show you when I'm dressed in um, a blue uh, a blue raincoat, right? It's kind of like a raincoat, but it's a jacket that can also act as a raincoat. I'm going to show you that, right? And then I'm going to show you another um, attire where I'm still putting on the inside is the same. The only thing I'm going to change other jackets one of them is blue the other one is kind of like blackish or greenish it's more like black uh, like uh, black right like a dull or what's the word I'm looking for a faded uh, black so I want you guys to tell me what 
comes to mind or what difference do you see right away is do you see any difference if there is a difference what difference are you, uh, do you see then of course i'm gonna uh, i'm gonna tuck in my sh uh, my, my t-shirt uh, then i'm gonna let it out and i just want you guys to give me the differences you see from the different attire when i have on the blue jacket when i have on the black jacket when i'm tucked in and when i'm not tucked in um what I, I i really would prefer is that you you look at at the videos and then take time to pause uh, the video and write your thoughts in the comment section below because i want to get your thought before i give you uh, the reason why i'm doing this so here are the videos give me your thoughts uh, take a look at them and then give me your honest genuine thoughts on what you think i know we are all going to have differences on how we look at things and uh, and the way we we want things to be but i just want from your perspective your honest genuine thought on these different attires just write them in the comment section before you listen to my reason why i'm showing you that then after the videos uh, are done you can resume this video after you, you've left me your honest genuine thought on what you think about it all right so this is the first jacket that i was talking about the blue jacket this is the jacket that i've been putting on um most of the time or well, let me say actually it's the only jacket i put on like when it's cold this is the jacket that i put on as you see right here it's not zipped and of course my t-shirt is not tucked in uh, what do you think of this look right here by the way this jacket also acts as my raincoat uh, i remember i made a video where i showed you how i use it together with uh, uh, pants to keep me uh, uh, dry from the rain so this is how it looks when it's zipped up if it's very cold and i need to zip it up that's how i zip it up and this is how I look. So what do you think of this look right here? Whether zipped or unzipped, uh, what, what do you think? What are your impressions? So let me show you the other uh, jacket that I talked about. Now this is the new jacket that I just, I just got. It's uh, the color right here. It, it, in the video you may you may look at it and you may be like is it uh what color is it but it's kind of like a faded black but what do you think about it just looking at it the way it looks right here uh, by the way for those of you that are interested in this jacket uh i got it off of amazon i will leave a link in case you wanna uh look at it they have it in different colors uh, but I chose the, this color right here. So now I'm going to show you another look where I just tuck in my my t-shirt uh, so that you you have a different look. So when I have my uh, my shirt or my t-shirt tucked in and I have this jacket on, uh, what are your thoughts? What do you think of how I look in comparison to the first jacket that I had on? Okay, I'm going to zip it up and show you how it looks when it's zipped up. The other thing that I didn't do with the other one, I didn't show you uh, how I looked with the other one uh, when my shirt is tucked in. So we'll get to that. But this is how I look in this one when it's zipped. So I just want to get your, your, your take on these two jackets, uh, what you think of them uh what comes to mind
now let me show you because i didn't show you this jacket right here uh with my shirt tucked in so i just wanted to put it back on to show you how it looks with my shirt tucked in when it's unzipped what do you think of that and the difference between these two jackets and right now i'm, I'm just gonna show you uh this is how i look uh, without any jacket uh, by the way, forgive me, that button right there on this sh on, on, on this shirt right here, I don't know why it just doesn't say it keeps on uh, uh, unbuttoning itself. But this is how I look when my shirt is tucked in. And this is how I look when my shirt is not tucked in. What are your take on those two, um, those two looks? Like when I have my shirt tucked in and when my shirt is not tucked in. I appreciate if you guys can leave the comments before I tell you why I'm making this video. So just those are the looks right now. Okay, so those are the uh, attires. Now, let me explain why, um, why I'm doing this. Um... One of the things that I used to, to do is really, I used to take pride in the way I used to dress uh, before I came to tracking. Um, from, from my teen years, I used to, it's something that I really loved. I don't know if I, I would say loved per se, but it's something that I cared about or something that I would pay attention to how I dressed. I used to like to dress sharp, if I can use the word sharp. And um, also, well, because of uh, some of the work that I've done in the past, uh, it has required me to put on, uh, to dress professionally, where I would be in suits and ties. But when I came to tracking, things changed. And it's because with tracking, you have this kind of um, attitude that no one cares because you are in your truck especially when you are over the road you are in your truck you sleep in your truck you wake up in your truck you drive for miles you just get out maybe to fill up the tank or to use the restroom you are back in the um, in the truck you are then at the shipper and so before you know it you really just don't care how you dress whatever t-shirt you find whatever jeans you find whatever however your shoes look you just don't care about how you dress and one of the things that really really blesses me is when i run into truck drivers that look sharp that really dress well they take the time to tuck in their shirt they are clean they are well ironed their shoes are polished whenever i meet such a driver i just feel so blessed and just so proud of them um rarely do i meet them but when i meet them oh my god it is it is something that i feel like they challenge me but i am also proud of them because just by the way you i by looking at them they uh, they command your respect um in the scriptures there is where the bible says that god looks at the heart but man looks uh, uh, at the outside and let me tell you there is a difference when you look at people even the way they dress uh, somehow there is a respect somebody can earn just by the way they look and so for me I think now that I have a, a, a wife and children and my family man I think there is something that marriage and uh, and being a parent does to you and so for me it's now something that I have to think about where I'm like okay these children um, I'm responsible for there, there are things that I am responsible to teach them uh, things that they look at me and I may not just saying them is not enough but they look and watch they are seeing how I, I dress right and so it doesn't matter whether I'm a truck driver or I'm, um, I'm in an office or what how I dress matters because that is the um, um, should I say the impression I'm giving them how a man should dress and so i think uh to me at least i would love um my girls to appreciate how people dress 
And of course, them being girls, uh, as a parent, of course, you also think ahead and you're like, okay, uh, how are they going to tell uh, the difference of how to dress even themselves? Or if I don't dress well, how will I be able to tell them to dress well if it doesn't start with me? Um, not only my children, but my wife. My wife is a hard wife. Uh, I mean, she, she is hard. And, and of course, that is in my eyes. And she dresses really nice. And sometimes I feel like um, it's almost like letting her down when I don't dress the way I should dress. So one of the things that I desire to do is to start working on on dressing well again and honestly it feels like now i don't know even how to dress at all i don't know uh, how i should look uh, for me to dress well it doesn't mean you have to go and buy expensive things it just means that you have to know how to dress well and so one of the things that I've, i realized is i spend most of my time at work so how i appear at work is important so um, I want to leave home looking good so that when my kids look at me, when my wife looks at me, there is that appreciation of how I've, I'm dressing. And when I come home, I want them to appreciate how I dress. Um, it is something that really has been on my mind and something whenever I meet a, a driver that really is well-dressed, just blesses my heart i know for sure that um some of the drivers out there that bless me are the walmart drivers they are in their uniforms uh white shirts well tucked in blue they usually have uh, on blue either blue jeans or blue khakis and well dressed when you meet a nice a nicely dressed clean walmart driver they bless me and uh, i know i've seen a couple of drivers at um at jb hunt at our terminal that really dress nice and those just make me feel feel proud of them and they also challenge me so one of the things that i really want to do is i want to get back to dressing well as i said it, you don't have to be expensive but dressing well where you are representing your family um, even as a christian it's a way to represent god i'm not saying that um Again, because when it comes to uh, to fashion, we all have different um, different ways of looking uh, at things. We have different opinions. So I'm not saying that uh, just because I want to dress in a certain way, um, it's a disrespect to some other people that dress in other ways. The only reason I share this stuff with you is because I regard you guys as my friends. And again, for me, driver success is a place where I just want to share my experiences um, where I look at you guys as friends and just share with you some of the things that go through my mind because I know that through doing that um, I talk to like-minded people uh, it may be an inspiration to somebody else maybe there's somebody else that had not thought about it that may also just start thinking about it or somebody that has been thinking about it and is like oh yeah Moses that's what I want to do too so uh, that's why I, I, I love sharing some of these things um, that are not just about tracking but beyond tracking I just want to share my experiences so the reason why I showed you that is because um, I just want to say that I want to look for a way to start dressing well again a way where um, it also brings respect not only to me but also to the industry as I say personally when I see a driver a truck driver that is well dressed it blesses my heart so maybe there's also somebody out there who's who feels the same way that when they see a truck driver that is well uh, dressed they are blessed so maybe I can be a blessing to somebody else in that way anyway I just wanted to share with you that I know it's kind of like a rambling thing but as I said you guys uh, I regard you as friends so it's okay for me to ramble and just share with you my thoughts because driver success I don't want it to just be about tracking but I want it to be about sharing my experiences in hopes that it will bless somebody else encourage somebody else inspire somebody else who knows anyway until next time stay blessed and stay safe bye bye